Hello everyone, happy Thursday. It's going to be a good Thursday for me because I don't have to get up for work tomorrow. I booked the day off. So I'm going over to my daughter's to uh, help her pack her house up. Uh, she has a completion now for next Friday and uh, then she'll be totally in her new house. So uh, I think that's where my weekend's heading in helping her get her stuff across. Uh, a boyfriend's, he, his stuff's already in the new house. So uh, good uh, times for them. Uh, so my video today, um, now this beautiful project bag my uh, daughter bought me. I keep it at the side of my stitchy chair and I just keep still pulling projects out of my cupboards and drawers and it's it's just getting out of control. So uh, it's, I'm just getting more and more on there, there's more in there. And I just wanted to keep it to a minimum that they were the ones that I was stitching regularly. So um, I've ordered some more um, of these zippy bags uh, because I've got even more kits coming. So if you remember what I said, uh, maybe, I don't know if it was the last video, the video before that, that I'm just going to do a dedicated stitch and I'm not going to do anything else. Yeah, that lasted the weekend and then I've been uh, stitching on other things. Uh, and then I also said I weren't doing any orders. And what did I do? I ordered from VIP Cross Stitch and I ordered from AliExpress. And if you watched uh, Stitching with Laura, she uh, gave me a mention and... I've enabled her and she's made an order. So uh, we're as bad as each other, really. <laughs> uh, so I'm going to go through the one. I've not stitched on all of those this week. Um, I'm going to take you through what I've stitched. And um, then I just want to uh, get rid of some of these, hide them in the cupboard. Uh, so that I'm ready for when my new ones come uh, and then I've still got some that I need to start so I'm in a dilemma do I start the ones that I've got just so that I've started them or do I continue stitching on these ones so let me show you what I've done so far so this one is the yard the beautiful Chinese yard. I absolutely love this one. This is the one where there was a thread missing because this, I think it was colour 19, 734, and they sent me like 739 or something. Uh, I did hear back from VIP Cross Stitch. They contacted the factory and they said, it was actually the correct colour they sent. Uh, it was just labelled wrong. So, uh, looks like I'll be going with that. Uh, so, from here, you can't really... It's another busy one, like um, New Orleans. You can't hardly see what you've done till you look at the back. And you can see I've tended to... Stay in areas and then I've gone a bit rogue in the last couple of days. Started to get the try to get the tree in, been working on the uh, pavement. Then I went over to the corner where the flowers were. But uh, it's beautiful. I love working on this one. These are like different dark blues in there. So uh, I, I love working on this one. But then little demons in my mind keep saying, stitch me, stitch me. And I have to go and pull another kit out then. So uh, let me 
pick another one what I've been working on. So uh, I've been working some more on uh, this uh, spring kit. Beautiful colours in this one. And again, I put some more threads down here. Then I've started to pick out the blue, which is this dark brown. Uh, I put some more into the house itself, which tend to be like creams and a bit of a pale khaki kind of a colour. Start to pick out the trees and get some more colour. I love this colour. Beautiful. Um, another really nice one for stitching. And from the back, it looks like I've done loads. Yeah, so I like that one. That's another good one. I've also worked on the Silhouette uh, Cinderella. 14 count this one. And I've just been filling in a dress really. Um, this was done before. Such a simple stitch. I love it. I just haven't got enough time to do what I, I want to do. So uh, I definitely uh, recommend that. And if, if you're not bothered about stitching just one colour, uh, especially black, just change it out for another colour. I definitely recommend this one. I love the Cinderella coach. Beautiful. And finally, uh, this is what I was stitching last weekend, where I made the decision, I need to finish this and not stitch on anything else. So I concentrated on this one last weekend and it was amazing. I got all this bit done, then I fell out with it again. <laughs> so now I've just got this bit to do. So I've just got to fall back in love with it again. Um, because then the other cross stitchers were shouting out to me, stitch me, stitch me. So it's uh, getting more and more complete. So I think that they were my main stitches last week. Uh, so we'll have to see what am I going to do? Am I, am I going to do a new start? Or am I going to go with one of my existing projects? And I've got plenty. So I'm going to sort my project bag out again and uh, keep that at the side of my chair. got in there. Let's have a look. So yes, my summer. Again, not a lot to do on that one. Just got the bottom panel to do. Um, and I think I was working on that top band. And also what's in there? It's my Quaker Turtles. That was the wardrobe. Mount Fuji Jigsaw Puzzle. I've not been back to that and that's nearly finished. Uh, oh, the beautiful tapestry one. And last but not least, what else have I got in there? Oh, my shirt, actually. What's that one? oh, that's the um, that's the wardrobe one. So what's that other one? What's this one? 
Let me check. Just fastened it. Oh, that's really good. There's no canvas in there. Oh, that's okay. Problem solved. It's my um, barn house. I'd lost her uh, canvas then. And empty bag then. Just got my cards, cards in, scissors. Yep. So, great little bag to have at the side of your chair. Just put your main projects in and then you can just keep dipping in as you get to feel the need to stitch on other things. So yeah, just got all this to sort out, decide what I'm putting back into my project bag. So happy Thursday, everybody. And I will see you soon. Take care. Bye.